All right, well, I just got home from work and I know that my new G JBL 305s came in. So I'm excited to go see where they are. All right, so don't mind the boxes. We're right in the middle of moving and getting set up to uh, move in January. And um, these new speakers are a little gift to me for Christmas and for my birthday. So here they are, the JBLs, they've been sitting waiting for me and I'm super excited to get them set up. And the next time you'll see me, I'll have them set up on my desktop. Welcome back. So I got the new JBLs, 305s. I'm super excited to try these out. They're the MK2 series, 305s. And so they're five inch uh, woofers and they have this like supposedly amazing tweeter built in and you can't find a bad review on them. And I got these for $99 each. So it's basically $100 off for both of them. And it was something that I wanted to get for a while to upgrade because I had recently just got myself an audio interface. I picked up this, the Mo2 M2. And um, so I'm super excited to use the, these speakers with the uh, Mo2 M2. And um, I'm super pumped. It's kind of like being a teenager all over again and getting a stereo system. Now, I'm not all into the specs with this, but I just wanted to get something that was going to be great to listen to. And I have them kind of set up um, facing me each way. And they're supposed to hit you in the in the ear, kind of, these tweeters. So the, my right one is a little low. But I am going to be moving in about a month. So I didn't put a ton of time into setting everything up from scratch. So, <clears throat> so um, I just want to kind of get into what they sound like. And so when we... Uh, I want to open up a couple music files and play these files. And so you can hear how amazing they do sound. So let's start out with some music. Check the mic and make sure it sounds right, boys. I can't tell you how amazing it is. I don't know how they do it. But when you listen to this bass, it hits you like right in the middle. It's amazing. So there's no subwoofer on this, and this just hits you right in the middle, right here. I don't know how it happens. I don't know how they do it, but it's just amazing how this music just fills the air in here. And I'm not kidding you. Like, you can hear every piece and every instrument so crisp. I've never heard anything so clean before in my life, so this is a new experience to me. So now you just got a five inch woofer and you're listening to these bass notes and where they hit and you're like, how are they doing that? How's the sound just filling like I have a subwoofer in here? It's amazing. So I'm just like totally pumped. And when you hear these for the first time, you're blown away. I mean, I was playing some sticks, I was playing some ACDC, and I was blown away. So this music that I'm playing now is not copyrighted, so you can listen to it. We won't get in trouble, but I wanted you to hear how good everything sounds. I mean, Every note just so clean. And the amazing thing is, and you can see these speakers right here. I have the white version. I did not get the black version. The black version, they, they're so glossy looking and the fingerprints um, that are on them would be driving me crazy. 
you had to get the white. Now, if you tried to get these last year in white, they would put, charge you like $50 more per pair. So I was psyched at Guitar Center. They had these for the same price, $99 each. So I want to play a little bit of like a rock and roll and so you can hear this. I mean that guitar. It just blows me away. So if you're looking to you upgrade your desktop, this is the way to go. I mean, there's no doubt about it. These sound amazing and you'll be blown away. So both of these cost me $200 for the pair. And then it got some XLR cable cables that go in the back of my audio interface. And I'm just playing these for my audio interface. And I think, you know, because they're powered, so you don't even need an amp or anything. They just play from your audio interface and they're powered speakers. And there are about 41 watts each, I think. But it's such a clean amp in these. So when you're cranking out 41 watts clean, and so, uh, it's it sounds fantastic. So you can watch a bunch of different um, reviews on these, and everybody is pretty much blown away about how great they sound. But I think they might even sound better in white. Because now, when I'm listening to them, I don't see the finger marks all over the black ones like you would have because the glossy finish so in white it's not usual for me to like anything to get anything in really the white when everything else i have accessory wise is black but i think those look really great in white and i think that most people would be really happy with them so like and subscribe join me on my journey on my youtube journey start with me right now um, I want to thank anybody who has subscribed to me recently and I'll see you on the next video and have a great holiday season.